Thank you guys for tuning in to Life Mirror Television. So my name is Bolotisa and today I'm going to talk about three important things about the more Facebook na Ogaobina. The first thing I end up to talk about ni story ya marriage ama wedding kati ya Ogaobina na the more Facebook. Number two, I'm going to give Ogaobina his flowers. And number three, I'm going to talk about the men's mental health work yenye ubina liorganize on 3rd of August. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe to our channel and uh, thank you very much. If you are a, go, uh, a, a returning viewer, please like this video, subscribe and share with your friends. So, the number one thing I want to talk about is the issue of marriage and wedding between Oga Obina and uh, Demua Facebook. In my previous video, I mentioned that the Moa Facebook has been saying that Obina ni buwanayake. He has been calling Oga Obina baby. Na Obina ajawai resist sana, ajawai resist sana. Nikasema, the Moa Facebook ni demu ya Obina. Nini, uh, so many viewers muli comment pale mkasema ati ho, story yangu ni story ya jaba, ati ho demu wa Facebook ana wana act, ati wana act to, si ati wana date, ati wana itana hivo juu ya kipindi, ati yo everything they are doing ni kipindi, si ati ni ukweli. But the latest development zimetuonyesha that actually si kipindi, hiki hitu inaka ukweli. Hii kitu inaka ukweli, but uh, and I want to tell you the reason. Reason number one. Kama haingi kuwa ukweli, then oga ubina ange, jitokele, ange jitokeza apologize kwa demu wa Facebook. Mnaona hile siku ali demu wa Facebook ali jam, hadi ubina kakuja, ali chapa ubina tension, hadi ubina kakuja mbele ya kamera. Haka apologize, haka toa pete ya hapa, Haka mwakea ha, hapa na demo Facebook, haka accept the apology. Kama hawa watu wawange kuwa wana date, ama kama hawa wapange kuwa na future, do you think oga ubina angefanya kitu kamba hiyo? Let's meet in the comment section and tell me what you think. For me, I think, kama hawa uh, watu wana usihano, then I don't think oga ubina nge apologize by kuvalisha demo Facebook pe? Pete. Before that, kulikuwa na story, na video, ati demo Facebook na ubina walikuwa meanza kureceive wedding gifts. What does that tell you? That that is, that is something that insinuates that kuna wedding ina, ina pangwa. And of course, usijiulizo ni wedding ya nani, definitely ni demo Facebook na oga ubi. Ogaobina. So, my another question. Kama hawa watu, hawange kuwa wana, wamesha hint story ya wedding, do you think wange wange fanya something? Awa story ya wedding gifts kuanza kuingia, do you think inge any story wange tuonyesha? Kama si yeti ya wana, kama wana story ya upanga wedding. So, hizo ndo vitu zenye mini kiangalia zina ni convinced that obina na demu wa Facebook wata wana. The third thing yenye nafanya ni believe oga ubina na demu wa Facebook watawana ni story ya ngoma. Kama umekuwa kifollow oga ubina na demu wa Facebook, I know you are aware that oga ubina amefanyia demu wa Facebook song. Song inaitua na mposti. Ukisikiza tumesikia hiyo song kia sikiasa na sema ati ni memficha, sasa leo na mposti. What does that tell you? That, kama na mpost ina kukuna maisha, these people are together. These people wako strong kama, ha, kama nyororo. Hawa watu, we just give them time. But at the right time, hawa watu watawana kwa sababu hawa watu wanapendana. Mi, I believe, mwenye haumpendi uwezi mtengeneze angoma. Hmm? Mwenye haumpendi uwezi mshutia video, video quality. Ha? Mwenye haumpendi, yeah, always invest kwa ki, hata always mleta kwa program yako. So me, I think, oga ubina na demu wa Facebook, watawana na wanapendana. Hmm? And I know, naturally, kama unakana 
mwanaume akikaa na mwanamke hata kama wahusiani hata kama wamekaa kikazi there's a time obviously kuna ka feeling kuna love feelings is to develop and i think that is the thing between the two so for me i think that these two people wanapendana and at the right time wata hawana the only thing that i request is that to see wape pressure sana <laughs> unaweza kumbuka uh, the other day yobina kitoa pressure akis alisema ye ata, anafanya mambo yake vile amepa vile amepanga he will not succumb to pressure he will not succumb to pressure from different places he will not succumb to pressure from different fans so let us not give them pressure let us just support them the second issue that i want to talk about is i want to give ogaubina his flowers when someone does something good then we need to appreciate them and in this case i want to appreciate ogaubina for for giving back to the community um mnaza kumbuka juzi alisema uh, under the uh, the obina tv network sasa hii ameongeza watu wenye anawa support apart from uh, demo wa facebook ana support uh, prophet ama mama county akaongeza badman ule kijana mwenye anaweka uh, mabad suku kwa kichwa the guy ameongeza magix enga na ameongeza nani mwingine the bad bo, the bad man akaongeza magic enga the mwa facebook ako pale alafu akaongeza kimani the journalist au ni wenye watu wenye sasa hii ogaubina anawa support that is something very important that is a special way of giving back to the community and so i want to thank you so much ogaubina for that kind of uh, work you are doing we have so many leaders we have so many celebrities we have so many uh, people who are well off out here but they can't come out and support people like uh, those people who need our support so shima kongole so thank you so much for supporting these people guys and uh, if god widens your basket please consider many other people to support Uh, thirdly i want to talk about the mental health work yenye ogaubina literally organize it is true that mental health issues is a real problem in our society today it is affecting us everywhere especially in our families families are breaking because men are suffering from depression anxiety uh, stress na kila kitu Uh, due to maybe unemployment poverty and so many uh, pressure from different uh, sources family and very many other sources so thank you ogaubina for creating that awareness uh, thank you so much because this issue is real the world health organization says that out of four people one of them has mental health issues it means place kuna ogaubina kuna omosh kuna mama county na kuna badman one of them lazima kona mental health issues that tells you how this mental health issues is highly prevalent in our societies so thank you for organizing that program thank you for uh, giving us a starting point kitu yenye naomba ni kwamba let us support this program let us not just leave it on uh, ogaubina stable let us spread the word outside and uh, even get more support to su- get more support from different sources to create more awareness that mental health issues is real hiyo kitu ni real hiyo kitu inasumbua vijana hiyo kitu inasumbua wanaume hiyo kitu inatesa inafanya wengine wana ha, wanataka kuji mada inafanya wengine wanataka ku ha? so it is a real problem in our society let's create awareness if you are a lady out there support your man mentally financially physically and in everything because the pressure the tension the depression anxiety they are just so much so thank you for your support thank you ogabina for starting the journey for us uh, thank you for watching this video 
please like subscribe and share and uh, may god bless you